meet Eddie Acker, a mechanic from a small town in Michigan. A pretty big guy by any standard, but that's nothing compared to his truck. Size of the toys, size of the boys. What I kind of a, job? What do you do? I, I'm a mechanic. I fix cars for a living. Oh, cool. Fix them for a living, and then I destroy them on the weekend. In the U.S., it's part of the culture. Giant pickups that run on testosterone and sweat, leap like heavy ballerinas, and have a bus or two for breakfast. That rate right there just burned 20 gallons of methanol alcohol out of those trucks. 20 gallons. <laughs> Millions of Americans fill the stadiums every weekend and shout in joy every time a truck is turned into a two-dimensional vehicle. In the coming weekend, the Israeli audience will also have a chance to see the junkyard recycling show. <laughs> Yes, the national stadium looks more like the Andorra national team's rickety court, and the victims of this week's destruction are waiting on the sidelines. The trucks are saving it for the audience. The only way to get in is hop up on these tires and just climb through the window. This one's the gas pedal. The this is the brake pedal. It's nice and big. Brakes are important. What is this for? Uh, in case people get out of hand. <laughs> Who is the bigger one? Now that's getting a little personal. Right? <laughs> so if you thought these guys on four wheels are crazy, as usual, truth is in the eye of the beholder. What do you think about the Israeli drivers so far? They're crazy. <laughs> I just say anybody wants to drive like that, bring them on out here. We'll give them free parking. <laughs>